Guys, I'm angry. Like, I'm super mad right now. This is not the video you guys were supposed to see. And the video you guys were supposed to see today was an epic video that all doesn't make sense now if I uploaded it because it's all going, to, it's all horrible. It wouldn't make sense if I uploaded that video now. So, today you guys are getting a recorded video and an edited video all in the same day. So, bear with me. Today's video is a story time video, so you already know what that means. Go get your snacks, your drinks, and sit back and listen to this stupid story that I have to tell you guys today. It's, the title is probably something along the lines of how idiots ruined my SMP. So as you guys know, I used to play Minecraft over, well, I used to play Minecraft Bedrock Edition, and I was not really having too much fun playing by myself, if I'm being all that honest. So I figured for season two, I would start an SMP on Minecraft Bedrock Realm. Now, let me tell you why they're idiots, right? The realm has been up for five days as of today. On day number four is when everything went bad. It went terrible. It all went down the toilet drain. Whoosh, you already know. Terrible. So, let me just give you guys a quick backstory. So, my cousin and his two friends are the ones who I invited to this realm. And then one of the friends has a girlfriend who I then invited her to the realm. And then... I invited my other cousin who hasn't joined the realm yet because he was uh, in the middle of getting Nintendo online for a Switch and then he was going to join. But now he don't even have to do that so he can save $20 right there. But you don't care about that. Basically, the main four people are me, Steven, Eric, and Robert. Which are all fake names by the way. I don't want to give them their real names because I plan on not even giving them the time of day no more. I, I feel like I'm completely done. Because all I did was ask them for one thing, one thing, and that was to get on the ramp, play on it, and behave. Don't be acting up, don't do nothing. Like, I'm tired of people acting up. Like, this, the saying is true, if you want something done right, do it yourself. And that's why from here on out for we are going solo, like, I'm done, like, I'm not gonna be collabing, like, forget it. Forget it. I'm t like, do you see what people do to you? So let me talk, start you guys off on day number one. So I didn't record day number one because I felt the need not to because I figured we were just going to be mining and looking for a place to live, right? So nothing too special there. And that's exactly what we did. We mined, we explored, and while we were exploring, we came across a ruined portal. Now, Steven and Robert really apparently wanted the chests, which it wasn't worth it. This ruined portal was in the side of a mountain, like a sand mountain, so you had to like break all the blocks to get to the chest. And Steven and Robert really wanted this chest for some odd reason. And they literally killed each other for it. Well, actually, I think what happened was Steven killed Robert. And then our other character, Eric, killed Steven. So both of them, people who wanted the chest, died. And when I got to the chest and I opened it, it was worthless. It was like some gold armor and some um, seeds, which... You die over some gold armor and seeds, really. So after that happened, Steven decided he wasn't coming back over there where we were at. We were too far or whatever. He wasn't coming back. He stayed over at the spawn and he started collecting some materials over again. He was like, forget it, like I don't need it. And I, bro, I even offered to reset the world. Like I was like, look, if you guys are upset already, we can reset the world. We haven't got that far into the game. We can reset it and maybe get an even a better world. And they're like, no, 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 like, we're fine. Like, I'm chilling with this world. Like, we can do it. Robert ends up coming back to getting his stuff. And I guess he was already, like, half dead. Because after he collected all his stuff, he fell and got some fall damage and insta-died. And he literally left the game and left our call on Discord and everything. Like, he just left. Like, turned off his computer, whatever. Like, he literally just left. So over, and he's like, I'm never getting back on. Forget it. Like, he was done, right? And I'm like, what the heck? Like, you guys are already starting off bad on day number one. And I know, like, with Robert, he, he likes to do that. Like, he likes to play, play around like that. And I'm just like, bro, you're such an idiot for that. Like, stop wasting my time. But anyways, Robert goes offline. So it was just me and Eric over there. And we collect his stuff and we put it in a chest and we bounce. We head back over to spawn to get Steven. And we all decided to live a couple blocks up from spawn. But yeah, we end up settling down, and honestly, I don't really get back on that much. I'm going to be honest, I haven't really got back on because I was setting up my stream. I have been planning on streaming, like, once I decided that I'm fully going to take this Minecraft thing on, I decided I am going to be streaming, because Minecraft is a grindy game, and I literally, 
was setting up my stream for a couple days, right? And I was like, starting this July 2nd, I'm going to start streaming, which I still plan on streaming. I just don't know what I'm going to stream anymore. But anyways, I setting up my stream, so I'm not really getting on there. But Eric and his girlfriend have actually been on there. And she plays this on mobile, which is a little bit hard, which I don't know why she would do that. She got a Switch. Get it on the Switch. But anyways, they play every single day. And they have made advancements like no other. Steven, he actually has a house that he built into a mountain, but some of it's coming out of the mountain. And the part that's coming out of the mountain is wood. So keep that in mind when I tell you guys this. So my rules basically were come on the world every so often. You don't have to come on every day, but please just don't give up on it. Just, you know, come on. Build, like, build up a house, like, build up a world. Like, I wanted this to work. I'm, I'm a technical player, right? Like, I like to build redstone creations. I wanted to build iron farms. I wanted to build a villager breeder. Like, I was literally already getting materials for it for when I was playing those couple minutes that I did play. And, like, I was ready. Like, I was ready, ready, ready. Right? So... Now this happened between Wednesday night and Thursday morning. So Wednesday night I come home from work and I record the video you were supposed to see today. Which is a basically me announcing the SMP and showing you guys a world tour because Eric had done so much in that little bit of time that I had to show it. When I went online last or Wednesday night, guess who was online? Robert was online and I thought that was strange. So I was like, oh he said he was never getting back on but now he's on. And he's on without being in a call with either of them, right? Like, usually, if he's getting on, it's because one of them told him to get on, right? But he just went on there for his, by himself, I guess. So when I go on the world on Wednesday night, the world is fine. Like, nothing has happened. I do go to my chest, though, and I notice that there's a diamond in there, which I didn't mind any diamonds. So I was just a little bit confused on where the diamond came from. So keep that in mind also. So Wednesday, let me tell you guys who was online. So it was Eric, Robert, and then Eric's girlfriend were all online, right? And then I hopped on just for a quick 10 minutes to record that video, right? And then I got off. So Thursday morning, I get a text message from Eric in, the, in our group chat saying, Damn, damn Robert, I seen what you did to Steven's house. Now remember Steven's house is made out of wood. All right, you guys remember that, right? And no, nobody knows like what he's talking about, right? So I actually have to get back on. I got on again to go show you guys the girlfriend's house because she's kind of funny about people going into her house. I don't know why, but in their previous worlds, she was funny about it. So I didn't want to go in there while she was in there. So I get on Thursday morning and I see that. Like, I was like, oh my God, like his house burnt down. Like his house is burnt down. Like the part that was in the wood, like the part that wasn't in the mountain burnt down. Like all the animals he had were gone. His horses were gone. All his food was like practically gone, right? We don't know what happened. Like I didn't know at the time, I didn't know what happened, right? So Thursday comes around and I'm at work and they're in the group chat, like basically fighting, like fighting. Like I'm getting literally hundreds of messages. Like my Apple, not to mention, guys, I told you guys I started um, Eric's Creators Now. I had the Geneva app on my phone, and Eric Eric opened up the Geneva app, and I started getting hundreds of thousands of messages from Geneva and this group chat. And I'm just like, oh my god, like my watch is gonna die. Like it's just vibrating. Everything is just vibrating. I had to put everything on mute for a second and just calm down because what was happening? I didn't even know anything that was going on. And then, like, I'm reading the message right. For some odd reason, right? For some odd reason, Steven and Robert decide to team up. I don't know why, because from my perspective, this is how I looked at it. Uh, yeah, Robert said he was never getting back online. And all of a sudden, he got online and your house is destroyed and you side with him? How does that make any sense? And then Steven tried to say, nah, I know that it was... Eric and Eric's girlfriend who did that because they play in the world all the time like they're the ones who messed up my house It hit me later on right it hit me later on what happened To his house So you guys know how copper is in the game, right? He decided to put the freaking lightning rod, rod Attracting things on top of his house and in a realm. I guess he doesn't know this the time doesn't pause the time keeps going So in those five days could have been a hundred days, right? It just keeps going. So, his house was struck by lightning because his stupid self 
have they lightning rods on his house? And I was like, I know exactly what happened to your house. You idiot. You freaking put those lightning rods on top of your house and that thing caught fire. Like it caught fire. Like you're over here like blaming Eric for burning down your house when it was you. It was you the whole time, right? Right. How can you be mad at Eric and do that? So then Steven and Robert go and blow up Eric's castle. Eric literally built a castle and they blew it up. And I was like, what, bro? Like the time, like I'm at work, like I can't do anything about it. Cause usually I would hop onto the world and I would sort everything out, right? I'm the middle person always calming everybody down, which I'm done. Like don't ask me to get on no more. But anyways, they blow up his house. They kill him. He had like 60 levels or something crazy like that. He told me and they killed him. So remember I said I had a chest on the side of the mountain? There was a diamond in that chest, right? So I'm assuming somebody went into my chest and was messing with my chest, right? So Robert, no. So Steven later on goes, yeah, I'm missing wood, I'm missing iron, I'm missing da 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 They stole my stuff. Like, first he was just crying that his house burned down and that's why he's doing it. And now all of a sudden it's because his stuff is stolen. I backed up the world last night when I came home. I didn't get on the world. I didn't even look at it. As soon as I got home, I just hit back up. I backed it up all the way till Wednesday morning to give everybody a whole fresh start. Like, fresh start. No house burning down, nothing. Like, I know it happened over the night, but I was just like, nah, we're gonna back it up all the way to the whole day. The stuff that I had done to my little plot of land in the video is all gone. Like, I was okay with that. Like, I'm like, we're gonna restart, right? We're just gonna get a whole day back. And he was mad, right? He was mad. Steven was mad. I guess he was on the world at the time. It didn't tell me. It literally said zero people were online. And I guess Steven was freaking mad that I reset it. He literally left the group chat too. And I was like, you know what? After that, after I seen all that, he left the group chat. He left the realm. Like, he did, undid his invite. Like, he closed out of it. Like, I would need to reinvite him again in order to join. Like, he literally left everything. And, you know, from that point on, I realized, like, I'm not dealing with these people no more. They fight too much. Like, I'm done, right? And that's how I got to the conclusion today of I'm closing the realm after four days. Well, five, I guess, if you count today. But now the reason why I'm saying this is because... Now, now going back to my chest. So after I backed up the world, right, I went to my chest and I had a whole bunch more stuff than when I had went on the Thursday morning to see... I had way more stuff in my chest. I had way more iron. So the only logical thing I can think of now is that Steven put his stuff in my chest. And when I moved my chest over to like where my house was going to be at, he had put some of his stuff in there and didn't realize it. And that's the only thing that I can think of because I knew I never had a diamond, but there was a diamond in there. So I ended up having two diamonds at the end because I ended up giving... I ended up giving Eric 25 iron for a diamond, which I was like, okay, this will be our first diamond. It'll be good because I can hang it on the wall now and name it our first diamond. And I remember when I went to my chest, there was already a diamond in there and I was super confused, right? Like I was just like, okay, well, I already have a diamond, but I didn't mine for a diamond. But I, I didn't question it. I was just like, okay, whatever. Oh, so, yeah, pretty much long story short, they're all idiots. This part, I don't know, but I'm assuming he put his stuff in my chest. I just, that's all I can say, is he put his stuff in my chest. And that's why he claimed to be missing wood and missing food and missing iron, because he was taking it from me. So that's all I can say about that. And now, if you are still watching this video and if you are wondering if I'm gonna be playing Minecraft again, yes, I'm gonna be doing my own season two on a solo world again. I'm done, I'm not, I'm not doing it. To simply put it, I'm going to be doing a solo world. I'm going to be starting over with the new 1.17 or whatever we're on right now. And we're just going to be going onto a new world. And I'm just going to be posting weekly videos of that. It's just going to have to be me. It's not going to be them. Sorry, guys. I really wanted to do a special kind of series for you guys where I'm actually interacting with other people. The streams are going to be lit. The videos are probably all going to be solo. But the streams themselves were all going to be played with them. Like, I was super ready. Like, I was like starting to get in grind mode literally all my stuff for my stream came like look my dummy battery came in yesterday my um stream deck the 15 keys is coming in today and then i'm getting um I f i'm gonna get a cam link because i got my bonus today like i'm literally ready to start streaming because listen as much as i always say i just want to be a youtuber flat out i don't want to be a streamer and honestly, in order for myself to grow in more places, I want to be active in more places. So I decided I'm going to start streaming, help grow up my YouTube channel. 
So starting July 2nd, I will be coming back with some streams still. I don't know what we're playing yet. We're probably going to just be playing Minecraft on a solo world, which is kind of depressing because I really wanted this to happen, like Breezy S&P. But whatever, you can't please everybody. But that is going to be it for today's video, guys. This has been Breezy, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out, everybody!